Eminem is one notoriously private celebrity. We know the rapper still lives in his home state of Michigan where he's chosen to remain despite his fame and fortune and it just may be the same spot he bought back in 2000. We don't know the details of his long time abode but it's said to be in the Clinton Township area of Michigan while his former mansion in the nearby Rochester Hills is back on the market for $3.25 million. This crib spans 17,500 square feet of space with almost six acres of land and lavish amenities. So it sounds like that price tag is actually kind of a deal. Today, we'll check out where the real Slim Shady calls home. We even found the listing. In these videos, we don't reveal any addresses and even though I've done a house tour of my own place, please do not show up at any private residences because it's not safe for anyone. Marshall Mathers, better known as Eminem, is a rapper, songwriter, and record producer who's among the best-selling artists out there. Eminem not only sold an estimated 220 records worldwide, but he's also been credited for popularizing hip hop in middle America and considered one of the greatest rappers of all time. At the time of this recording, Slim Shady is enjoying the fruits of his success with an estimated net worth of about $230 million. While that's enough to buy a handful of mansions in Hollywood, Eminem has chosen to stay true to his roots and remain living in his home state of Michigan, even after all these years. Mind you, his current mansion is quite the come up compared to his childhood living setup. Hey guys, it's Kara the Vampire Slayer back with another exclusive house tour here in Famous Entertainment and this time we're looking at where Eminem calls home. Don't forget to like, subscribe and hit me up on Instagram if you want to chat and let's get into this video. While some fans claim that Eminem still lives in this Rochester Hills mansion, by all reports, it's his former home. Recently, the mansion has also appeared back on the market. This time, it's for sale at $3.75 million, and now reduced to $3.25 million. Located in the Rochester Hills neighborhood of Detroit, Michigan, this home sits on a whopping 5.69 acres of land, backing onto Stony Creek Metro Park. It seems the current owners are even advertising a helicopter landing space on the lawn in the listing photos, because why not? Eminem bought this mansion way back in 2003 for $4.75 million, hot off the success of his early albums like Slim Shady and the Marshall Mathers LP. He owned the home until 2017 when he sold it for just under $2 million, unfortunately at a major loss. The gated mansion has sprawling grounds stacked with every amenity imaginable. Before stepping foot inside, you'll already be entertained by the tennis and basketball court, private walking trails, and multi-level swimming pool and spa with waterfall and nearby cabana. Aside from all the terraces, the yard even has a pond with fountains and a 2,000 square foot guest house. Inside, the impressive mansion boasts 17,500 square feet of space with six beds and 10 baths. Considering it's said that Eminem's current house is slightly smaller, he may have realized he didn't need all that much space. The home has been updated with high-end electronics, audio, visual, and lighting systems, along with custom features like imported materials and detailed woodwork in rooms like the games room, bar, and dining room. The entryway here has high ceilings and an open-air feel, and the nearby great room or party room is grand and dramatic, wrapped in cherry paneling with coffered ceiling to match. Even the fireplace here is done in cherry wood and takes up nearly a full wall, while right across there's a fully stocked bar to impress guests. This space attaches to the equally impressive games room or billiards room, and further down the massive dining room with long table and chandelier. While all of those spaces follow the same aesthetic, the other common rooms are different. The mansion boasts a more casual family room and living room with terrace access, while the latter offers a double height ceiling and stone fireplace, as well as a gallery level above. There's also a dream kitchen with twin sub-zero refrigerators, a butler's pantry, and double islands, while an elevator helps residents easily get around the three-floor home. If that's not enough, Eminem's former mansion boasts guest bedrooms which each have their own theme, as well as a massive master suite with personal office, private deck, and equally huge attached bath. 
Elsewhere in the home, there's also a fitness center. This mansion actually used to be known as the Kmart Mansion because the former owner, even before Eminem lived here, was Charles Conaway. He's the previous chairman of Kmart who ran into legal issues when his crooked financial dealings led the department store into bankruptcy. Anyways, when the rapper initially decided to move home to Michigan after hitting it big, it surprised some in the entertainment world. He also bought a second mansion in the nearby area of Clinton Township, which spans 8,000 square feet. This mansion that's on the market is usually the one photographed as Eminem's main home, but it's reported he's actually spent more of his time in Clinton Township raising his daughters. The rapper has said in the past he wanted them to grow up not affected by fame, money, or privilege. That being said, Eminem's current home remains somewhat of a mystery. In 2000, when he was still married to his ex-wife Kim, the rapper bought another home in the area of Clinton Township, Michigan for just under $1.5 million. This property was built in 1986 and offered about 8,900 square feet of space, along with six bedrooms and 9.5 baths. It's said that this home has actually remained Eminem's primary residence throughout the divorce from Kim, and it seems like his ideal family home. Unfortunately, we haven't been able to see much of the mansion's interiors, but we do know it sits on about five acres of land, and it's said that there's an impressive master suite, along with a total of 21 rooms. Not to mention, the grounds are perfectly landscaped and Eminem even has his own lake. To go with the private lake, there's a fishing dock and other features on the property include a tennis court, a golf course, and five car garage. Eminem's daughter Haley is not as private about her home life as her father is, and it seems these days she's enjoying being an influencer. While some claim Haley still lives with her dad, it's been reported that by 2018 she was already living in her own four bedroom abode, not far from the family mansion. She's shared more glimpses inside her home where she took photos with her dogs Lottie and Wolf. Haley has posted in her large bedroom as well where we saw a black bed with white sheets, cream carpeting, and a floor to ceiling mirror. Haley also has a white fireplace in her living room surrounded by some plants and cozy blankets. And it appears her house features a lot of neutral tones. So now we've taken a look at where Eminem lives, including his former mega mansion in Rochester Hills, Detroit, and what we know about his mysterious current home in the nearby Clinton Township. After seeing that huge mansion he used to own, what was your favorite part of the house? I love the dramatic party room that was decked out in cherry wood with the full bar and entertainment wall. It was just so unique. Unfortunately, I can't ask the same about his current house because, well, we just don't know that much about it at all. Except that it's likely the same property he bought way back in 2000. Seriously, I don't know how Eminem keeps things so private. Anyways, be sure to let me know your thoughts down in that comment section. Thanks for tuning in. Don't forget to follow me on Instagram and let me know which celebrity homes we should check out next. I'll see you all in another video. Bye!